Puberty menorrhagia is a condition where there is excessive menstrual bleeding, which is uh, more in amount, that is 80 ml, more than 80 ml, and duration, that is more than 7 days, uh, between menarche and the age of 19 years. In adolescent age group, uh, the cycles, menstrual cycle varies considerably. In the first year of menarche, usually more than 50% will be uh, anovulatory. That is, patients, uh, girls will not ovulate normally. So after three years, usually this comes under normal range. That is, 95% will be normal cycles. So we are going to evaluate the other 5% which are which fall out of the normal range and what see what is the underlying problem. In most of the cases, it is the immaturity of the hormonal axis. There is a connection hormonally between the brain, uterus and ovaries. This is immature in most of the girls during the first few years of menarche. Uh, then another cause is endocrine causes like thyroid diseases bleeding disorders then another one is infection like tuberculosis uh, another very common uh, condition which is causing this problem is pcod nowadays that is a lifestyle mismanagement this will eventually leads to hormonal problems usually they will present with features of anemia uh, features of infection bleeding disorders and features of pcod PCOD means there will be obesity, uh, irregular cycles, heavy bleeding, uh, hair fall, pimples, like that. Investigation includes uh, blood tests for anemia, bleeding disorders, thyroid disorders, and also an ultrasound to see whether the ovary is having polycystic changes. Condition needs a very sensitive approach because it is a very stressful condition for both the young girl and also her parents. So, uh, most important step is to control bleeding. For this, we have non-hormonal tablets and hormonal tablets. First, we try non-hormonal. If it is not controlled, we go for hormonal tablets. Then, um, we treat anemia. For this mild anemia, you, have, you can give iron tablets. If it is severe, we may need iron injections and blood transfusion. Uh, and treat the cause like PCOD, thyroid diseases, blood, dis blood bleeding disorders, all these we have to treat and reassure the patient because it's a preventable condition, you can control it.